So this is why you may feel like you're getting attacked a lot or something like that, or you feel like you're um, getting targeted in some way, shape or form. Just remember, wherever this resonates, just match it, all right, Joe? But you feel like like people, all eyes is always on you, or you just feel like people is just pertaining to your business is because where your light is, it attracts them. And it opposedly attracts the attack because they see the genuine that you care. Like these individuals are in a one-sided competition with a lot of you. So they're in a one, like they're competing against God's children, the ones who are meant to shed light. So that's why when they see your light, they can't feel but, you know, confused and like more, more succumb to attack you or to try to get a negative emotional reaction from you. Okay. Because they really don't really like your light. They're really hateful. You feel me? So this is why they invest a lot of their time to figure out what you're doing. Like they want to know what you're doing right now on the planet. Like I'm telling you, like a lot of them going to be trying to watch you, stalk you because they know you're doing big things and they're jealous. Like they are quite aware of what you're able to do every single day. They're upset at all the accolades, all the business adventures, all the potential that you have every day they're upset by that yo so i'm telling you guys right right now this is what makes them upset you just try to be to yourself but they're just upset that you just like god rewards you so easily and that you're just so happy and that a lot of great things happen for you like a lot of great good luck you know are being bestowed to you a lot of rewards and blessings and things are more in your favor and working out for you more than ever and they can't help but watch and stalk you because they're jealous of the light that you hold yo i'm telling you you know they feel like it's not right they feel like that you get to have this they they feel like it's not fair that you have this like hole or you have this like this important life and you know what i'm saying and this is why they decide to take a position to be your enemy you feel me so like they don't like you, but they admire your light and they try to be you. But they say or they claim that they don't or they claim that they can't stand you, yo. Your enemies are so upset. You feel me? Like, they got that itch to stalk you, to watch you. This is why they pry to get information on you because they need to know what you're doing. They try to, this is why they pry and they stalk you to get intel on what it is that you got going on because they can't help it. They want to see where you're going. They want to see what you're doing. They want to see like what you're working on. These people, yo, they want to see what you're actually doing in this present moment. Like they want to just keep tabs on you. Like they want to have every bit piece of information on you, yo. You already know. This is why they'll like sit up. If you got some kind of social media, they'll sit up late night. They'll sit up, you know, throughout the middle of the night watching your lives, trying to uh, trying to figure out information, trying to figure out your next, you know, what you got going on. They'll even try to like look in other things. Like, I mean, because they're jealous of you. They can't, they can't stop watching you. They're confused because they know they don't like you. They know, but you're just the subject of their conversation. Like, because they can't be you. You feel me? Yeah. This is why they cannot stand you. They, if you're a chosen one, they cannot stand you. If you ever found people that just did not like you, like based off the first interaction, they did not like you because they can't stand your light. You attracted them, but they still, you attracted an envious person. You feel me? Jealous people aren't even this notorious. Jealous people are just people who are, haven't reached your setting or haven't reached the, reached the goal that you have. These envious people are people who don't want you to have it. But they're not reaching for what you're reaching for. They haven't actually put in the work, but they don't want you to have it. That's the difference between a jealous and an envious person. They obsess, you feel me? Because they know. Listen, they know deep down. The reason why they hate is because they're secretly, you know, spiteful, jealous of you. They know. So this is the reason why if you have enemies, this is the reason why, because they're jealous. They won't support you. They do not. They don't want anyone else to support you. All right. Because they understand you're real and you're always going to maneuver higher. You're elevating higher right now. And this is why they're hating on that. This is why they decided to make you their priority. Number one, they took like a focus. Like these people are focused on hating and despising you.
if you're if you fall under this this category, a chosen one, you just have that high illumination of light, and your your light attracts these you know these in, these individuals. They just can't hate and move on from you. They will hate on you, watch you, hate you. Like they will just see like what you're coming into, and they it just makes them more upset. Like this is what they get angry about because they don't like to see what you got going on, like what you have like entering your life right now they don't they don't like that yo they even have problems at night where they can't where they can't sleep yo they have trouble sleeping at night or staying sleeping in the middle of the night because they're up tossing and turning or they've been up tossing and turning thinking about you thinking about your you know your accomplishments and think, thinking about your goals and what you're coming into they don't like this yo Whoo, no wonder why they'd be asking where you're going what you're doing where you're going next like this is the reason why they do that because they want to uh they want to compete with you. Like, I don't know. You would think that because they didn't like you, they'll leave you alone. But they don't like you, which is the reason why they can't help by being indulged in what you got going on. And they couldn't just let you be. They had to hate on you, but try to, like, intervene into your life. Like, they only wasn't just, these haters wasn't just standing on the sidelines hating. They are standing on the sidelines trying to intervene into your life. They're definitely jealous of you because why would they hate on you? It's the life that you live. This is why they stalk you. This is why they ask about you. Your enemies? No. They always try to look in on your life because of jealousy. This is the two main reasons of why the enemy are like stalking you or why the enemies are lurking on your life. The first one is because they want to see whether or not the attack that they're doing to you, whatever the ploys, the plot, the schemes, the shit that they've been putting on you or they've been the slander, the negativity, they want to see if that's working. They want to see if it affected you negatively, all right? Because it makes them feel good, all right? That's why, pretty much, that's why you see, like, synchronicities or see situations where you find, like, the most high guy speaking to you because they want to see, you know, it's just what it is, all right? And... It's coming from the people that claim they don't, but they do like you because they want to see if whatever they're doing to place in your life, like whatever they're trying to transfer to your life, is about to manifest and they want it to affect you. So they want to see you in despair. The second reason why they were lurking in your life is because they know that you're great. This is why they hate on you. See, the thing is, they intervene in your life because they love to hate on you. Because they're jealous of you. So this is why. So so they love to just peek in on your life just to, you know, throw, throw some hate. You feel me? Because they feel with so much jealousy, they have to release that. It's like getting your fix. They have to fix themselves with re relieving that energy. You feel me? All right? These individuals watch you because they know that your life is great. And that's why they're jealous. And that's why they're hateful of you in the first place. There was no beef. There was no nothing. There was no two-sided competition. You were never competing with these people. You've never had some kind of quarrel other than this. You're not beefing with these people, but you've you don't you don't give them the benefit of that beef. You feel like you're too great to beef with such peasantry. So there was no beef once you recognize the synchronicities and the signs the universe been telling you. You just took back your power, your energy, and you let them deal with the consequences of their own beef. That's their beef that they have with themselves. They don't have no beef with you. They have that beef with themselves because they don't love or like nor want to be fond of whatever you want to say themselves. So that's the beef that they have towards themselves, not, not you. They don't have any beef with you. They hate themselves. All right, because you never did anything. This is why, like, you figure, like, they're losing their mind, you feel me, over the life that you built from the ground up that they cannot steal, that they cannot affect. So uh, it is what it is, yo. Hit that like button. Thank you, everyone, who's been showing love. Chosen one, support each other, so we appreciate the support, man, because, you know, who else would be, who else would be for us if it wasn't us for us? It's just be for real. Like, who else would be there for us if we wasn't for ourselves? Notice how... People are not for each other and things are a little more like dry, a little more cold. Yeah, this is why chosen ones are meant to bring that back. We're meant to enact certain purity love. We're meant to enact bringing back, you know, people's pure side, people's pure state, doing things, doing great things, doing chosen, show, shedding love, providing a higher, a higher way of a higher way of interacting with people because you know you could do it this or you could do it that all right y'all so i'm gonna leave that i'm, I'm gonna leave out with that but yeah yo thank y'all so much if y'all need it one more time it's ihe inc cash app 
it is what it is. Hey, we about to come up with another one of these. All right, y'all.